the end was a stylistic <laughs> choice. Hi, y'all. It's been a while, so hello. So this is something new. And it's titled Once Again for Those in the Back. Change. If you think about the grand plan, the big picture, damn, that single word can lead to massive distress. We get comfortable in our routines, our defense mechanisms, our rationalizations, our comfort, and even our safety. It's better to know than not, right? But all of those knowns in a very real way can and will bleed breed complacency if you let them. And let me be very clear, complacency is truly intrinsic death. You stop growing, trying, striving, evolving. Evolution is not only about what we are taught in science class or from history. Survival of the fittest, what a sick joke. To think so small is a brash disservice to your epic human soul and belittles your true capabilities. I, I myself am unfit at times. I am also and always worthy. So are all of you. We are also, all of us, extraordinarily capable. But without true intention, our capabilities mean nothing. Without change, our intention to grow numbs. And then fear seeps in. Fear of being uncomfortable in the unknown, fear of the judgment of embracing change, and ultimately, the fear of failing to succeed in our very attempts to change. Let me tell you, everything you could ever want might actually be on the other side of that very fear. The question is, do you want to regret the not trying? or revel in the knowledge that you tried and failed, which provides you another attempt to, at the very least, try again. Me? Well, I'm going to fail perfectly and then succeed beautifully. And we're all going to call that triumph. Thank you.